took pictures when I was a kid in school and stuff, just for fun. My mom gave me a camera, and then I started working for people, it just as a job. I played in bands, and uh, little by little just started taking pictures, and I would work with people, and I thought, like, if these guys can make a living taking pictures, I'm gonna give it a, you know, give it a go. And then worked with my father for a while and just learned as much and just kept taking pictures, you know, and um, and working and kind of, and now kind of, you know, was able to make a living and, and create a life for myself. And uh, yeah, it's been great. Oh, let you know, darkness makes the light more cold. I mean, my, the first image that I was kind of known for was I did, it, it was an accident. I did it for this company called Catherine Hamnet, a designer, and um, I did a picture in a nightclub and a, a girl, I didn't even see, but I was shooting a girl and her legs were open and she had her pubic hair coming through her underwear. But I didn't see it because it was so dark in the club. And then when I got the film back, I saw this image and they ran the picture. And then I had always taken kind of like sexual pictures or, you know, pictures of people, but when that image hit, people responded to it and I realized and I kind of just, you know, I realized that was kind of what I was meant to, to do at the time. There weren't people doing really sexual pictures. It was a different kind of school going on. So I really came, you know, strong with that. I've been to Sao Paulo before like six or seven years ago and then um, with Mar Marcelo Seba and he, he hooked up the whole thing in Rio and like I came and with him, I mean, I think anytime you travel, if you're with someone that's a local and they know it really well, the, the place you're at, it's incredible. It was amazing to do this book in six days. We shot like 15 hours a day and we photographed just about everything and everybody we could in that time. And it was, you know, it was a great experience. trabalhado com o Terry na Meg, né? Que ele fez uma matéria para gente e ele é muito tranquilo, ele é muito sossegado. Então eu visto o modelo e explico mais ou menos o que é a roupa, o que é importante, qual é a proporção e ele segue. Ele é muito tranquilo de fotografar e tem essa assinatura que é super forte e importante, né? Terry brings his own his own energy to the shoot. It's not necessarily what he what he what he says to me directly, but I, I get an idea of what he wants because he, he he directs me during the shoot and with the clothes, and so it was very, um, very strong. I just put on music and then I just talk to people and then I, I like to let things happen organically. You know, I like to let people, let like, blossom and like evolve in front of the camera more so than being do this do that you know I like it when I'm surprised and people because I find when you once people get going it they warm up and once they get they you know they it builds and builds and to me that's always a nice way I don't like pushing people I mean you obviously you'll give suggestions and when you're shooting but it's nice when people just kind of you bring I don't know what it is some sort of charm or magic or whatever to have people open up in front of me you know Trabalhei com ele, trabalhei há muito tempo atrás, numa foto, na casa dele, e, mas eu encontro ele quase praticamente toda semana, porque a gente mora uh, na, no posto, na mesma rua, em Nova York, então eu tô sempre andando minha cachorra por lá, quando ele tá andando com a cachorro dele, então tipo, a gente já tem uma relação, assim. Usually, it's hard for me to edit. I have my guys go through it just to kind of Swanson and them that work with me. They narrow it down. They pick, up, you know, get rid of all the ones, the, the off bad ones or whatever. But uh, I don't like. It's hard for me to edit when I shoot, you know, because shooting to me is very like emotional and exhausting a bit. So I usually, you know, I like to go through it in the next day or, you know, a few days after. And I usually do like two cards, so it's like two or three rolls. You know, with digital, it's great because you just you delete everything you don't like. It's amazing. So, but I don't like to do too much, you know. So I think people. It's about a rhythm and stuff, and you'll burn people out if you do too much. You know, you can tell when the subject gets tired. And I have a short attention span, too. I think, for me, good images are quick. They're just quick bursts of energy. Hey!